Hello once again. It's me, Noah the Panda Tank, back again. Once again, here with you today for another chapter of Alfred and Jerish, a space adventure. Chapter point one. Stuff begins to develop. But not, not character. We are not developing characters. Jeez. Alfred and Jersh arrive at the nearest place that used to contain human life, Planet M.K. Zuckerberg, M.K. 1. However, when they landed, they found many ruined buildings with, with like symbols from Facebook strewn around. Alfred also noticed the paw prints in the mud, still fresh. He licked them. He fucking licked them! Among the ruins, Alfred and Jersh find a single human corpse. It say on the shirt, This guy's dead, but I'm not. Come find me. XD! 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 Alfred didn't know whether to make of this as a joke, or if the person was serious. He decided to stay a few days to try to find this mysterious person. So when he sat down, and started beating the ground with his head. Maybe the vibrations will notify him that we are here. Jerish replied, what? Do you think she is a mole? Stupid. Josh proceeds to cry out. Here, person, person, person. Here, person, person, person. Nearing night time, Josh set up camp and built a fire of like symbols because Alfred had a minor concussion from banging his head on the ground for three hours. You know, we don't know if he actually found anything. He could have. He could have woken up some, like, maybe actual moles. Who knows what's on planet Mark Zuckerberg? At night, they heard strange noises. Alfred thought he saw shadows running in the corners of his eyes, but he thought it was probably just his concussion. Dude, this is three spooky, five me, get me up out. Oh my god. While Jish was keeping watch, a feral comet wandered into their camp and bit off Alfred's left pinky finger so that he couldn't backspace to type cohesive comments on Facebook. Jersh did absolutely nothing to stop it, because he still wanted to be able to troll a lo 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 When Alfred woke, he didn't notice, because he's stupid and concussed. He got up to go to the bathroom, which was located in the dark web. However, he activated a trap card and got sprung up 1,232 inches, by the way, that's 34 meters if you're metric, into the air. While looking at the ground, he found that the ruins was actually formed words. The ruins said, looks like you needed to go to the bathroom, motherfucker. Now go northeast and you'll find what you're looking for. Maybe. Depends on if you're looking for me or not, loser. Alfred fell down to the planet once again. And after 195 days of recovery, he was able to walk and speak to Jerish once again. End chapter point one. That was a relatively short chapter today, guys. I will be releasing another one in the matter of days because I know that that one was short and I am late on my uploads. Do not worry, I will get to it. If you are enjoying the series so far, be sure to hit that like button down below and subscribe so you do not miss any episodes of Alfred and Jerry's A Space Adventure. Next up, Chapter Point 3, Further Exploration of Planet Mock Zuckerberg. Maybe they'll find someone. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.